for always mining. They're in the gate. And they're off in the stymie. Musical heart being hustled out of there by Dylan Davis. So too, Mr. Buff and Manny Franco. Outside always mining. Leaves for position as well. They've opened up four lengths on Limonite. And Tintoretto is allowed to trail the field. Mr. Buff launches speed today and leads them out of the chute and onto the main track by a length and a half. Always mining outside in second. Musical heart forced off the pace today in third. Quick first quarter, 22-4 and four in the slop. They have a seven-length gap back to Limonite and Tintoretto, who's about a dozen lengths from the lead, and the leader is Mr. Buff. He takes them up the aqueduct backstretch, a length in front of Musical Heart, a length and a half back to Always Mining, who's in third, a big gap to Limonite, probably a half a dozen lengths, and even further back is Tintoretto, 45-2, and two. a grueling half mile here, Mr. Buff, Musical Heart on the chase. They've opened up a half dozen on Always Mining. Limonite begins to make up some ground along the inside. And then we come back to Tintoretto. The field is making their way to the quarter pole. Mr. Buff keeps on going on the front end. 109 and 4, 4 three quarters. Mr. Buff a two length lead. Musical Heart has dead aim at every chance to run him down here in Queens. Mr. Buff, two and a half lengths. Musical Heart keeps coming. Limonite trying to chime in past the eighth pole. Mr. Buff's almost home. Musical Heart, Limonite down the center. Mr. Buff needs the wire. Limonite needs two and a half lengths. Mr. Buff, Limonite. Mr. Buff holds by a half length. Limonite ran out of real estate. Musical Heart was third. Final time for the mile in the stymie was 136 and four.